welcome back to the channel. Uh, we've been making more progress towards prepping for winter. And uh, Wiley, why don't you tell us about what you've been doing? So this is the beginning of our rock wall. We've got it up about waist high, a little over waist high right now. But I use some really big rocks uh, to make a foundation basically and to get up a little ways. Now we're gonna go with a smaller rock and bring it up. So I'm gonna be making a double stacked 55 gallon drum wood stove. So we'll have a wood stove set in here made out of 55 gallon drums and that will heat the rocks up so the rocks will contain the heat and kind of help out you know over the winter or over the night and everything as the fire goes down the warmth off the rocks will help resonate a little heat off of it uh, but anyway now we're collecting some clay off the property and mixing it with water and making us a uh i don't know grout chinking whatever you want to call it to seal in between all these rocks and that way we can get the next layer started so yesterday i milled up another cedar log and i got some more of the wall stacked together there um although a lot of people are mentioning that they love the cedar and we love the cedar also but we're using what we got guys there might be a cedar board there might be an oak board there might be a hickory board we don't know just we're just going to use what we've got and what we've got down and i'm going to be milling them up as of right now it just so happens you know the the first couple was oak the rest of it's been cedar so far because that's just what i grabbed and threw on the meal but it's going to be a mixed match of just about everything honestly i am going to try to stay away from pine but other than that it's going to be a little bit of everything whatever's laying around you want to help too where do I put it? It don't have to be all the way through, Mikey, just a couple of inches. Any cracks. Okay. Any cracks you see. Oh, okay. So like that. Okay. Okay. All right, y'all. I'm going to put this on time lapse because this is going to take a minute or a lot of minutes. So to make the viewing experience better for you, I'm just going to set this back on time lapse and let y'all watch. y'all yeah but it's awesome messy mess <laughs> <laughs> that's what working does to your hands Wiley the mud's made for the rocks not your glasses yeah well you're made to clean my glasses so <laughs> my shirt's not the cleanest as you can It's time to go find some smaller rocks to build that arch kind of thing that we were talking about. I'm gonna take you guys along. Thank you. 
we got a whole bucket full of rocks and I got my tripod stuck over there. So you can yeah. lay it down on there? I'm just kind of looking to see what we got. Assessing we your puzzle pieces? We need these bigger ones first for kind of a base, you know? Mm-hmm. I'm pretty sure I want that rock here. I like that rock being here. Just like this? Yep. That's got a good suction already. Yeah, it does. <laughs> So it's not a hundred percent complete. I still have to get some six inch pipe and run through for the exhaust for the uh, wood so, stove and uh, then we're going to build up over the pipe a little bit. So not a hundred percent complete but Emily has been out here kind of smoothing things up. Now the dirt that we got. Uh, probably wasn't a hundred percent clay I just went up and got a scoop full of it off of the front of the property and it is cracking just a little bit as it's drying it's not a big deal of course we just wet it up a little bit to smooth out the cracks no big deal um, but I love it guys I think it is gonna be awesome the inside to me is beautiful uh, it's so cool and it is gonna be I don't know I just, it's going to be fantastic. I love I, it. I want to put plants all over it, of course. If you've been following along, you know I like plants. I want to put plants all over it and maybe have like a, a ivy up here on the top, like sweet potato vine or something kind of growing down. It's going to look so cool uh, next year. I yeah. need more plants. Yeah. Yeah. Next year. Yeah, um, next year. I, I love the idea of sweet potato vine because I do believe sweet potato vine is just beautiful. It is. And it is. I think sweet potato vine growing all over this would be awesome. So. But, so it's going to go up just a little bit more. Like Wiley said, we have to wait on payday to get some stove pipe. Yeah. Um, you know, it's always a game of waiting around here. And then we'll be building that up a little bit more. And then we're going to build some sort of like a door that shuts and opens kind of like a shutter but it's going to open like this instead of like this so our idea is you know pretty much the full spance across here is going to hinge up and open that way during the summertime you can open it up and still get your breezes and you know cool air natural and stuff light and yeah and natural stuff light like that, so. but yeah once we get that figured out we'll let you guys know yeah let me give you guys a close-up of it Well, Wiley, I hope everybody enjoyed this video today. Uh, what, do you, what do you gotta say? I'm pretty proud of this wall, guys. I love it, and yeah, I mean. I can't wait to cover it in plants. Yeah. <laughs> I can't wait to get it operational. I can't wait to have the hood wood stove over here and you know, fire going in the wood stove. Yeah, I think it's gonna be fantastic. It's gonna be super awesome. And course we'll we still got a little bit to do so we'll show you guys you know the finished product uh when it happens and uh but yeah yeah this is the end of the video this what the do end you of say the as always work hard stay humble and love god amen